What would have been a routine visit by the head of the International Atomic Energy Agency has taken on added significance. Ladies and gentlemen, I am very happy to come to your country again. Yukiya Amano put a positive face on proceedings, but the stakes are high. It's his first trip since President Donald Trump told the U.S. Congress Iran is not complying with the terms of the nuclear deal or the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action. A claim Amano made clear is not true. As of today, I can state uh, that uh, the nuclear commitment, related commitments made by Iran under the JCPOA are being implemented. And a message that seemed tailor-made for the U.S. president. The most important thing is to be factual. On some, uh, I have been always um, uh, factual uh, since I became the director general of the IAEA. Sometimes I had to report the bad news, uh, but I also reported uh, the good news. And um, uh, um, uh, it is very important to stick to the rule, and I will continue to do so. For Iran's leaders, Amano's visit was an opportunity to air their grievances. So far, eight times the IAEA has released reports that state Iran has met its commitments fully. And addressing U.S. demands to inspect non-nuclear military facilities in Iran, journalists were told even talking about it was a waste of time. Military bases are not part of the deal, so it's useless to talk about them. The White House has said Iran's development of a missile program is a threat to regional security and violates the spirit of the nuclear deal. In a speech to parliament before meeting the IAEA chief, Iran's president Hassan Rouhani restated his country's commitment to its own defense. You know that we have built, are building, and will continue to build missiles, and this doesn't violate international law or the international resolution. The pressure to keep the peace is now on European shoulders. There are a lot of problems, uh, but still Iran thinks that uh, having the deal is better than uh, being out of the deal. And uh, if the Europeans and uh, the international community uh, sticks to the deal, Iranians will also stick to the deal. Inasmuch as Amano was in Tehran doing his job, this time his visit became a way of sending a message to any American officials that might be watching. Using the nuclear deal to pressure Iran will not work. Zain Basravi, Al Jazeera, Tehran.